Um, once again, really disappointed. Um, thought we, you know, we played well enough defensively. Um, hold Vanderbilt, you know, six below their number at home. Um, hold them to 20 field goals. And so I, I'm not sure. I don't sure. I'm not sure if Vanderbilt's won a game where they've had only 20 field goals. Um, I thought Jalen Williams and Janai Broom were terrific on the inside. Um, and uh, really, really hard to stop. And between the two of them, they had 14 field goals. And, you know, Janai had a three and Jalen had a three and the rest of them were all in the paint. I mean, to get points in the paint like we got, uh, 40 to 22. Um, and between them, those guys make 14 two-point baskets. Liam Roberts was a handful. He made three two-point baskets. And it was 17 for 20 from the foul line. Hard to beat. Yeah, so three times I got held below 20 and all three were losses, so. We're going to take questions here um, first before we Zoom. Hurt. What was your view on that last possession defense to retire? Um, put Zepp in, pressure the ball, um, put Dylan in maybe as a rim protector. Um, and we're switching everything. The idea was, you know, thought that five would go downhill, so put some size at the rim. And unfortunately, he he he, he came with a head of steam. Um, Zepp didn't do much to slow him down. Uh, and then he turned the corner on Jalen. Did not have a four fouls play into that decision? No, no, just doing, just doing defensively a little bit, get switched off on him. Uh, coach, what do you feel like was the biggest uh, impediment for Wendell tonight? He seemed to struggle all day. I thought the kid, I thought um, Miles, excuse me, I thought uh, uh, Ezra did a great job on him. Did a great, got up underneath him, just did a great job defensively on him. Made it really difficult. Well, I thought they I thought they were terrific. Um, you know, and they shot a great percentage, you know. Jalen is eight for twelve and Janai is eight for fifteen. You know, Jalen was eight for twelve and doesn't want the foul line. Um did a great job. Um uh, would like to have got it in there to him more. Um, but Leo, Bur Leo Berman had a great run offensively and, you know, made some big shots and gave us a great lift off the bench. Um, you know, Janai was under the weather this week. He had, the, he did not practice. Uh, he was, he was not feeling well after the game, um, and was out Wednesday and Thursday, came back to practice Friday. So very impressed with with the fact that he was able to get it turned around. He's a great competitor. Yeah. Bruce, another close loss for you guys away from home. What's kind of messing with the team, especially trying to trying to get over the hump and you know, win one of these close ones here, here down the stretch? Um you gotta get you gotta to, to win it to win at the end. You get stops and you get the foul line. We never even got to the bonus in the second half. You you win by getting stops and getting to the free throw line. Greg, we can go to questions there on Zoom. Sure. We'll start with a question from uh, Nubias Wilborn. Um, hey, Bruce. Um, how do you explain outscoring a team by double by 20 points? in the paint, but going to the line significantly less than them. How, how does that happen? No explanation, Nubias. There's There really isn't much of an explanation for it. And then as a follow, what did the reps say at, at the last few seconds, at the last seconds there on that, on the buzzer beater attempt and everything? I don't know what they were. I don't know. They were, <laughs> to add insult to injury, they didn't go off the court, but they decided to go take a look at it. I guess there was, 
Three tenths of a second left, say so set. Vanderbilt back to the line again. We'll go to Mark Murphy. Yeah, Bruce, did Vanderbilt do anything in the second half that made it more difficult for Jalen to get shots? They probably will a little stickier to him. That's, uh, I think that's all we got on the Zoom. Anybody else got a question, BP? We'll go back to any bias for one more. Um, just the KD three there to tie. What, what was it? What was the thought on that play? Everything. No, it really wasn't much. He just he was open to he pulled KD. He's got he's got courage, and so he had an open shot. He made it, and um, it was right right in front of me. And I I just let him you know kind of go out of space, and uh, kind of open up the floor. And he decided to pull it, and he's he's made shots late for us before. That's all we got in the Zoom. I don't think else in person. Okay. Okay, good. Thank you, guys. Thanks, Coach.